Have you ever flipped on a light switch in your home and wondered, how does electricity get to my home? Let's take a look into how it all works, from the power generation plants to turning on the light switch at your home. It all starts at a power generation plant, whether that be coal, natural gas, solar, or any other source of energy. The power plant turns these fossil fuels and renewable resources into energy through an extensive process. The power they generate gets distributed onto transmission lines. Transmission lines carry electricity in long spans to get power to thousands of people. They're the massive electric structure carrying thousands of volts of electricity you may see along the interstate or cross country. So how does the electricity that is on the transmission lines get stepped down to serve a single home? That's where substations and distribution lines come into play. Electricity from transmission lines feed into our substations. Through many pieces of equipment within our substations, voltage is stepped down to a level that is more suitable for the needs of our membership. Once the electricity is at a level that our distribution lines and equipment can handle, power goes out onto our lines and on its way to homes, businesses, farms, and other electric services. Whether you have an overhead or underground electric service, power gets converted from high voltage to a voltage needed for your home through our transformers. You may see transformers as cylinder-shaped equipment on our poles or a green box in your yard. From the transformer, power feeds through our meters to a breaker panel in your home. Within a breaker panel, there are a variety of switches that indicate where power is directed through your home or business. Power travels through the electrical wiring in your home all the way to the light switch. We hope this high-level explanation helps you understand how electricity gets to your home. If you have any questions, give us a call at 800-831-8629.